Hi, I'm Kurt and I'm with Traverse Tool Company. Have you ever needed some cutting oil or tapping oil and you just didn't have any where you were at the time? I'm going to show you a little trick that if you still have some other ingredients, you could make some good tapping oil. Some things we're going to need is just standard everyday anises and some penetrating oil. And we're going to mix them together and um, you can actually use that in a pinch as tapping oil. So let's see how it's done. So what we're gonna do here is just take some anises and just put a bunch of it in here. And this little pan that I have, it's not coming off the brush really well. Not going as planned. There we go. All right, then I'm going to take the um, the oil and give it a little I'm going to mix it together. Now, how much oil you use compared to the um, the NICs? It's really going to depend. Um, the heart of the material the th that you're you're going to be um, tapping or machining, the um, the thicker the uh, the lubricant should be, the cutting oil or tapping oil. Um, the softer material, so like aluminum stuff like that, uh, you can use it kind of a little more thin. I'm going to thin this out just a little bit more. Because I'm, I'm going to be tapping aluminum, so I'm going to have it a little bit on the thinner side. And that looks pretty good. Okay, so let's give it a try and see how well it works. I'm going to put a little bit of this on my drill. Just coat it a little bit. Well, that, worked, that worked pretty well. Just going to give it a little bit of a chamfer. That's enough. Now I'm going to coat the tap with my homegrown makeshift tapping oil. And let's see how it works. So that worked pretty well for us, as you could see, but um, for the long haul, I mean, there's really nothing better than something that's uh, some cutting oil that's made for actually cutting to use to be used as cutting oil. Um, my personal favorite is this Tap Magic Extra Thick. I mean, you can even use this stuff on titanium, uh, ink and all things like that, stainless steel, of course. Um, that's my favorite. You're not going to top that one, but if you don't have it laying around, maybe you're away from home and you need to rummage around for something just to make something with, make uh, some oil with, it works. So hope you enjoyed it. Hope you learned a little bit from it and stay tuned for other videos.